here. Okay, so now uh, we've been granted access to uh, have a little tour of the warehouse area. So this is the clearance cave. This opens up on the weekends. Wow. This is just okay. some of the stuff that doesn't get cataloged, things nice. like that. Some older stuff, maybe a little too beat up to yeah. be cataloged and stuff like that, but wow. still usable stuff. Um, we'll, we'll see more on that yeah. as we go. Um, come on back this way. Okay. Um, What's yeah. the square footage of this place? I'll tell you that once we get down here. <laughs> and there's so, just oh, everything that you see here is individually cataloged. It all has its own individual number. <clears throat> we got it broken up into sections. Keep on coming. Keep on coming. I love doing this. Oh, I got to ask about those. Yeah. <laughs> What's that? Those camouflage bags I just saw there because I'm an old army guy. So oh. I saw those camouflage bags. I don't, I got to know what that is. Okay. Uh, if it's what I think it is, I'll talk to you about it later. All right, cool. All right. So, I always have this somebody. Oh, Whoa. my goodness. That, so these just rows and rows. Uh, Indiana Jones, the first yeah. movie. That's exactly how it feels. Pretty much the same thing. Oh my uh, this is 35,000 square feet. <laughs> Wow. How many individual pieces do you guys have? Uh, it ranges. ranges. Uh, <laughs> as of right now, we're over a million individual wow. pieces. Um, all cataloged and bagged. All cataloged and bagged for their protection. Um, when we got here four years ago, there were 23 people on staff. Yeah. Uh, we now have over 100. Wow. wow. Um, we've, we've well, if I so if I move to Madison, maybe I could be 101. <laughs> <laughs> We are currently hiring for certain positions. Well, I'm I'm retired. For, I'm officially retired. But if I ever moved here, I would do that as a, as a part time job. Right. I'd be like, hey, I'll help out. You know. Yeah, exactly, exactly. So yeah. Building shelves, which is good. Yeah. Well, we're we're having to build more. We actually are planning an expansion, hopefully next year, because um, we are running out of room. Wow. These are lots that we've picked up that still need to be processed. Now, do you uh, guys go out and like? get stuff from other places and then bring it back? Is there somebody that does it like full-time? Yeah, we do have a purchaser. Yeah, we have a, a, a full-time purchaser wow. who uh, gets the, the new, we do new and used, so. Yeah. Uh, but we are the largest, uh, as far as for used games, too. Uh, that's also, we're the largest uh, store wow. like that in the world. Um, this goes all the way back to that wall. We'll head down this way. But like I said, each each item is individually cataloged. It's got its own unique barcode. Wow. Um, and uh well, that's smart to keep it organized yeah yeah, yeah. we're broken up into sections and uh okay so i i have a I, I have a weird question sure but it'll make sense after i ask it yeah. so we're we're both uh engineers operating engineers sure. he did it for 27 years and i did it for about 14 15 years sure um so I'm looking at the fire suppression, mm -hmm. and my biggest worry when I saw the pictures of this, like online, is I was like, man, if there was a fire, the water damage from the sprinklers Maybe would be bad time. enough. Mm -hmm. And I was like, maybe they did the um, like Energen, which is the uh, uh, the waterless, you know, fire suppression. But I see the fire sprinklers. I just yeah, no, nope, it's sprinklers. So. But I see you guys have it up nice and high, so like yeah. forklifts, ho mm -hmm. hopefully, because that's that's one of the hazards is the forklifts. We actually hit have no forklifts on, on site. Okay. We also have no shrink wrapper on site. Okay. So uh, the, cool. one of the biggest fears that people have when they get a used game uh, is if it's in a shrink wrap, what's missing, what's yeah. not. Right. Um, we also have a 30-day guarantee on all of our used games, which is really nice. So if something is missing, broken, not yeah. to what it was cataloged as, right. you have 30 days to bring it back, we'll make it right. Gotcha. Is, so and I've bought, I bought quite a bit of stuff from you guys online, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and... and well, your price might usually you're a little higher, but yeah, you have I know when you guys say it's very good condition, it's going to be in yeah. very good condition. Like okay. I don't have to, yeah, <laughs> right. I don't have to worry about right. trying to get scammed or or being scammed or anything like right. that. You know, we we so, back up what we say. Yeah. All right, come on back through here. Okay. Smile, guys. You're on YouTube. Hey, how's it going, guys? <laughs> this is packing and shipping. Um, this is where everything goes. That's where your order is gone through. Okay. So um, you order something, this is where it all gets packed yeah, up. These yeah. gentlemen do a, do the nice pack jobs and everything like that. Yeah. Um, so uh, this is the BSI area. This is where they uh, get everything ready to go back to the warehouse, uh, you know, wrap it up and all that other right. fun stuff, get the stickers on them. Uh, this is just, you know, all of our magic singles. 
Wow. You know, Pokemon singles and Yu-Gi-Oh singles. So, yeah, all the Magic players yeah, see that, this. That's, and just... that's all the catalog ones. Yeah. So there's more of that. <laughs> wow. Um, just can't stop saying wow. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, this is main receiving down here. The guys down there do that. Yeah. Um, this is uh, people dropping off, you know, orders. And, well, not orders. Uh, stuff to be cataloged and things like that. Stuff we're, we're purchasing. Um, wow. There's even offices. more. This is where the catalogers work and everything. Um, oh, my goodness. So. <laughs> <laughs> The organization of it is just mind It's mind-boggling, yes. It's, it's as many as the <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> but, sure but it's a labor of love. You yes. know, it's like... Yeah. Um, so, here's a game. Right? Yeah. yeah. All the catalogers, they're the ones that assign the numbers to all the different items. We have the trade specialists that go back here. They're the ones that take in trades from other people. Um, we have a room dedicated strictly to magic. Um, that is a locked, secured room. Um, and... We leave it that way. Right. No, I, I, I get, I get yep, I get that. Uh, boss's offices are in the back. Wow. Uh, and we go back through here. Oh. Uh, we're back, back out in the retail. Yeah. Now, one quick word of note. If you look behind you. I, we were I you. saw that, yeah. That is the actual yep. print. That How is Aaron. That? Aaron got it when TSR went up. Okay. He got right, it in a lot. Right oh, yeah. my God. We yeah. have that, which is the original. We also have the Shadow Run original oh, artwork wow. as well. Wow. Okay. Um, that's for sale. That's not. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. That, I, don't know, I can't even remember. Yeah, I'm sure that's the number on um, that. There's a gentleman from Denmark that really, 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 really wants that, and he's offered ridiculous amounts for it. Yeah. It's and just not for Aaron, sale. Yeah. It's a one of a kind. And I get, I get that. It's yeah. It's literally the only one. <laughs> yeah. So. Yeah. So. And so, what's your name? I'm Van. Appreciate the tour, Van. Not I really do. Absolutely amazing. Yeah, I'm, and now I'm going to do some shopping. <laughs> Sounds like a plan. All right. Thank you, sir. You bet. Thank you.